Servus, Chris Sig miteinander. Hi everybody, my name is Dieter von Schurer. I'm the owner and manager of the Ortolino Company. The Ortolino Company sells Japanese art prints in weekly auctions, Japanese prints like this one. And the topic of today's video is our archive. Ortolino offers more than just weekly auctions, a bunch more, for instance, 1,500 articles, and also an archive of more than 55,000 sold prints that are publicly accessible in this archive. And in this archive, these prints are shown with full descriptions, large images, and the prices that were actually realized in our auctions. This archive, to my knowledge, it's unique worldwide, and I want to show you that now a little bit in detail and explain you who has access, and um, yeah, there's also a trial version. Okay, let's take a closer look at that. We are on the homepage, we go to archive, and there we go to a general information page about, about what, about our archive. And on top you have a nice decoration. And here is a general, uh, the general information about our archive, uh, what it is, and uh, about the access. The access to the full archive is limited. It's limited to clients of Ortolino. What's the precise requirement? You must have purchased from us uh, since 2001 at least once, or you're an authorized consigner, and then you have full access to our archive. But which art objects are in the archive? Currently roughly 55,000 sold Japanese prints and about 2,000 sold contemporary Chinese prints. We do not show any unsold. Um, art prints. And not all sold objects are shown. Which ones are not shown? When you register your account, you have to specify whether you agree or not that your purchased objects are shown. And some don't want it, like for instance resellers. And also the consigner has an option to say, no, I don't want my consigned items to be shown in the archive. Okay, that's the um, most important information. And something else I want to point out, when you want to see your individual purchases, the prints that you bought from us, um, back since 2001, please do not go to the archive, go to your account, log in and then select from your account menu, my collection. Uh, then you see all items, no ma matter whether the consignors has agreed uh, to show them in the archive or not. Okay, the next, um, I'm going to show you our trial archive. This is for all those who have no access. Let's go back here, main art here, main menu archive, and here OKOE archive trial. The trial archive is kind of stripped down archive. I think it shows only 400 artists and only 12 prints from each artist. Let's go, let's select one, um, Daniel Kelly. Daniel Kelly is a contemporary artist, nice guy by the way, and um, I really like his art prints. There you see 12 hits. Uh, let's take a look at the first one. You see large images and detailed description what you see is precisely the same information and the same images that you see in our auction catalog. And 
you have the actual prices that were achieved here re the, re the original reserve and the highest bid in that case five thousand dollar wow it went out for the reserve navigation let's go back and here you can skip from one to the next but it's a stripped down version a trial version that shows you just 12 items by each artist and the artists are restricted to about to i think 400 artists just well that is it about our archive thank you for watching and I would be pleased to see you in our auctions. Goodbye. Have a nice week.